welcome to my channel. I am Lena. Uh, today is Mystical Monday, and I know I'm in the same pajamas that are in the videos for the past couple of weeks, and that's because it is Sunday, and I have recorded one, two, three, four, five, six, like six videos today. I think I'm gonna record like 10 of them. <laughs> I'm trying to get ahead of the game a little bit because I have so many notes and stuff to go through. Uh, and then I also just created a podcast. So I am reading through some of Neville's lectures and uh, trying to get ahead a little bit on uh, some of these videos because when everything is lifted and we can go back to work, uh, I will be going back to the office full time rather than working from home. So yeah, I just kind of wanted to get ahead a little bit. I, I can't really do that on like the other types of videos I post only because I usually, uh, when I create a video, it's usually because I'm inspired to do so at the time. So I can't get too far ahead. Um, on all of my videos but definitely with the dreams and any kind of ex like mystical type of experiences I have notes on those uh, so yeah I can get ahead so that's why I'm in the same pajamas that I have been in for the past few weeks all right today um, I'm gonna I turned on the camera and didn't even bring in my notes <laughs> oh but I've been up since like 4 30 a.m should probably go to bed here soon it's early though it's like six so anyway uh uh 12 30 2020 okay so this particular dream i had on december 30th 2020 i apologize for rambling a little bit but again i'm a little sleepy okay uh this one i didn't have like any like any clear kind of revelations as to any meaning behind this dream. But like I said in other videos, I'm just, I, I'm just sharing all of them. Eventually I'll be able to probably like form a pattern um, with with these dreams and experiences. Uh, and then I just share them because uh, I, mean, I figure maybe some of you guys have had some similar type of experiences. Uh, okay, so this particular dream, uh, I was with a friend. We were on an airport uh, tarmac and we were running to catch a flight. But the thing is, is we reached, we reached a point where we scaled, um, oh, my lips are super dry, where we scaled a wall or we're trying to scale a wall, but it was, it was made of meshed rope. And I want to say it's almost like it was, uh, was it going towards like the cargo area of the plane? I don't even know. I just know we were climbing like this, this mesh type rope. Uh, it reminded, <laughs> reminded me of basic training when I was in the Air Force and the, uh, this big netting we had to climb, uh, during basic training. <laughs> uh, there was a narrow entrance at the top and while we were climbing I realized we were going about things the hard way and um and the off to like our left there was like this huge large winding ramp that actually led to the terminal and you know now that I am saying this out loud I think I had this thought before but I didn't write any uh, let's see. Oh, I did have some notes on here about how sometimes we do things the hard way and we don't necessarily need to because there, there is an easier way. And I think that has something to do with the fact that, um, like when you awaken and you realize, uh, that Christ is within you and, uh, and you're always manifesting, right? but we struggle with so many things and um, 
and then we make things so hard for ourselves when really if we're just still um, and with ourselves and learn to observe our thoughts, then uh, things just become much easier. So I did write some notes here. Uh, that was kind of something that came to me is, uh, is like, like how so we do things the hard way sometimes that we don't necessarily need to. But anyway, there's this large winding ramp up to the left. So as we're climbing this mesh netting, you know, I realized that we're just doing that the hard way. So we stopped, uh, we dropped to the ground and then started running uh, up the other ramp uh, to the inside of, uh, of the airport. So we got into the terminal and up to the counter and then the dream ended. Uh, let's see. And that was it. Yep. That was it. Pretty quick dream. But, uh, but yeah, after when I woke up and I thought about it, I was like, yeah, some, is, is that what it meant? Or was there uh, any other underlying symbolism to the dream? Or was it just that, that thought that came to me about, um, doing things the hard way when we don't necessarily need to. And that was it. Okay. So I know another quick little dream here. Uh, I'm going to finish recording <laughs> some more and, uh, I'll see you guys in my next video. All right. You guys, thank you for watching. I appreciate it. And I hope you guys are staying safe and, um, I hope you're happy and uh that you're manifesting consciously manifesting great things into your life all right i'll see you in the next video bye